Welcome to Inside Sim Racing. I'm Darren Ganji and I'm here for a first look, first hour of gameplay with Forza Horizon 2. And I have to say, I'm really looking forward to this. I've got my Thrustmaster TX racing wheel. Got the stock rim hooked up here just so I've got all the standard buttons all properly laid out. Uh, running a set of uh, modified T500 pedals. Hopefully the TH8A works with Forza Horizon 2. I, I heard some guys, or read some guys uh, talking about the demo uh, saying that it didn't work, so I'm just gonna go off the fly here. Gonna try to condense this a little bit, so if there's some, you know, uh, loading screen stuff like that, I'll try to fast forward or do a little editing. So, gonna just boot this up and see what it's all about. So I have to say, I only got to try this with a gamepad at E3. Loved Forza Horizon. Uh, welcome to Forza Horizon 2. If you've played previous Forza games, look out for gifts in the message center based on your Forza reward tier. Cool. Uh, anyway, I love Forza Horizon 1. And uh, my wife really loved it. I'm sure she's looking forward to giving this a try. So i got to say, I'm, I'm really looking forward to it too. Okay, I'm going to adjust the brightness here. Okay, it says the clutch is the e-brake. Also, the B button's the e-brake. Why to switch camera? Open your eyes. Listen closely to the sound of my voice. With every word and every number, you move faster and faster. On the count of ten, you will be in Horizon. I say, one. Your pulse begins to quicken. Two. Your friends rattle in the back seat. Three. You're moving faster and faster, the ocean roaring beside you. Four. Your thoughts begin to wash away in a cloud of wind and dust. Five. Colored lights flurry in the distance. Six. The lights shudder. Everything lost in a thin blue haze. Seven. You hurtle faster and faster into infinity. Eight. The crowd thunders. Nine. You cross into a larger, more colorful world. On the count of ten, Everything you've ever known fades away. You will be in Horizon. I say... Ten. Cool. Fantastic news. The PR for the Horizon Festival has totally paid off. There will be a massive crowd at the dock to see your cars. So take it easy when you're coming off the ferry. When you reach the road, you can put your foot down. We'll head inland and rendezvous at the festival tonight. Got my opening race coming up here. It's not a race to get there, but you wouldn't want to be last to arrive, would you? No. Before we go, I, I just want to thank all of you for helping me get these cars to the horizon. Believe me, it's just a taste of what's to come. This is going to be the summer of our lives. <laughs> As usual, they, uh, at the start of one of these games, 
sure all aids are on. Or assists, I should say. Ooh. Feel like I'm in the Need for Speed movie. Full, full assist, automatics on. I'm assuming analog brakes, obviously the driving line's on. Hey, it's Ben. So, how's the car? As far as I know, you're one of the first people in Europe to drive that thing. There's a lot of people at the festival waiting to get a look at it. So, let's get it there in one piece, yeah? I'll try. It's a nice pass the AI made on the outside of me there. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Didn't see that tight corner coming up. Whoa, we pushed all over. Of course, feedback effects just off the bat are a little light. Hopefully, I can adjust those. Off-road in there. Turn left. Oh, day to night. Hey guys, you're listening to Base Arena coming at you from the Horizon Festival where the cars are rolling in, the party has started, and the hands are in the air. Come on, get down here, people. And one mile to the festival. I'm there. I made it to the festival in one piece. I think damage is off my car, it doesn't look like it's even scratched. I definitely was beating it up. Thank you, mate. Hey, you survived. So what do you think? Perfect mixture of music and machines, right? This was a long time in the making, but it's totally worth it. Um, tomorrow morning, you're gonna get fresh cars, and we're off on our first road trip. But uh, tonight, welcome to Horizon. Thanks for the welcome. I gotta say, graphics, especially in these cutscenes, are incredible. Being an older guy, I don't think I'm gonna be too fond of this music. But... Thanks for your help yesterday. There's only so many cars a guy can drive at once, you know? So you did me a favor, now I'll do you one. You're gonna need a car to get through the horizon heat. Take your pick from one of these. Sweet. So I got a BMW Z4, Z4, S Drive. 351S, a uh, looks like a 69 Camaro SS Coupe, Toyota Supra RZ. So I got my choice of these three cars. I gotta go American Camaro. Obviously, it's the least potent car of the three, but look at that thing. Classic. Nice. Ooh, 
the 69 Camaro. She's a beauty. Yes, she is. I'd love to have a 69 Camaro. This is your map of the Horizon Festival. Icons like this one represent key places and events at the festival. The Horizon Heat is a great chance for you to try out your new car. Set a route there now. Wait, they tell me to set a route here? Go on, set yourself a route to the Horizon Heat by selecting it. Oh, this one. That's the Horizon Heats. All right, I'll see you there. Well, wait a second, I want to make some adjustments. I forgot to say, all of our cars come pre-tuned to three festival radio stations. Horizon Base Arena, Horizon XS, and Horizon Pulse. All right, let's do some... Uh checking things out here. Let's start with settings, controls, vibration on. Oh, it's just switching them. All right, let's go to advanced. Okay, good, no dead zones. Everything felt good there. Seeing any uh, force feedback settings? That'd be kind of a bummer if the clutch doesn't work. All right, well, let's just check this out. Audio, radio. We're turning the radio down. I guess I, guess I could turn. I can't turn it all the way off. Do English. Leave the ghosts on. Names over car. Camera cockpit. Cool. Leave all that on. Difficulty. Several assists are turned on by default. You can earn higher payouts by disabling them, but this will make it harder to control your car. With simulation damage on, your car may become too heavily damaged to drive. When this happens, you can fast travel to the Horizon Garage from the game map. That's what I want. Drive Vitar, let's go pro, because unbeatable, we know, can be very difficult. ABS off, steering simulation, traction control off, stability control off. Oh, manual with clutch. Let's see if that works. Let's turn driving line braking only. Simulation, rewinds. Let's turn the rewinds off. All right, let's see if, uh, let's see if the stick works. Actually, let's check up top here what we got. Guess I can't make any adjustments there yet. All right. Oh, resume. That doesn't seem to be working. Okay, well that's a bummer. I've got it all hooked up, make sure it's plugged in. Maybe they're gonna need a patch or something. Oh, speed. We're organizing a little contest between you and your friends at the festival. You need to drive past these speed traps as fast as you can. Try it now. Nice. You can try it as many times as you like. Try and give yourself the best run up you can. In 200 yards, turn right. Turn right.
go, let's go do some off-roading here. sign up for an event, you just need to drive up to its marker and confirm you want to enter. Okay, enter event. There are no AI drivers at Horizon. All the opponents you'll face here are the yeah. driver tires of real people, driving in the same way they do. Some of them will be your friends, so if you beat them, be sure to tell them the next time you speak to them. Oh, I will. Uh, Are you ready to put those new wheels to the test? I am. This is the Horizon Heats. Finish in the top three and you get your festival wristband. That's the ticket to the road trip of your life. Go get it. Ooh, tuning. Let's check this out really quick. Tuning allows you to really get down to the tiny details. Tire pressure, gear ratios, suspension settings, whatever you want, you can tweak it here. Sweet. Nice. Looks like a lot of these things are locked though. Probably because of the car. Sweet. All right, I'm gonna try to turn the music off because Turn the radio DJ off. Kind of bummer I can't turn the radio all the way off. Let's check out the starting grid. Cool. 12 guys, I'm starting eighth. See what this is all about. I was turning my radio off. Let's restart this. Let's restart. Yeah, I was turning my radio off. I figured it out. Push to the right on the D pad and it turned the radio off. No okay, need for so radio. Work out. This time, you'll nail it. So I'm assuming based on my car selection, puts me against similar cars in this first race. Look at the driver tars battling, yeah. First is just running away, man. I gotta do some catch up here. You're doing well. Maintain that top three position to get your wristband. So as far as the handling so far, feels definitely similar to Forza Motorsport 5. And yes, it's Forza, by the way, not Forza. It's pronounced Forza. There's always somebody that's, like, how do you pronounce pizza? Do you pronounce it pizza? Or pizza? So it's Forza, guys. So anyway, handling feels similar. Force feedback's definitely a lot lighter Whoa, I can feel that uh, oversteer there. Force feedback's definitely lighter than in uh, Forza 5. That's it. I knew this wouldn't be a problem for a driver like you. You know what this means, right? You get yourself a yellow wristband, and you're coming on the road trip with us. Yeah. Man, Gypsy Slot was kicking some ass there.
Alright, so I'm about 20 minutes through my uh, first hour here. Got my wristband. What? Time spent in first place. Hey, I had a pro driver tar though, so. Gotta say, graphically it looks great. Now, I, I heard only 30 frames a second. That doesn't seem to bother me too much as long as everything's flowing properly. Probably getting to bed about four o'clock, which is why I feel the way I do. I'm speaking of which, morning. <laughs> Some night, huh? Now, there is nothing like a good road trip with your friends, so what do you say we enjoy these cars and take it for a nice cruise down the coast? It's not a race? Well, at least not until we get there. But well, you might want to keep your eyes on the road. Looks like rain. Hey, hey. One thing you need to know about Horizon. Showing off is just as rewarding as winning. From now on, showing off your skill on the road will earn you skill points, which you can use to unlock perks. In 400 yards, turn left. These guys are all frickin' number one. Turn left. Yeah! Smashing down some frickin' fence in there. That looks like I gotta do some more off-roading here. That's a good rubble. Oh! Look at that! earned a skill point. You can use it to unlock a perk. This is the perk screen. You can use your skill point to unlock a perk. The first perk will allow you to earn XP from the skills you bank. So it looks like I can only do this one. Unlock perk. Once unlocked, a perk is permanently active. Unlocking a perk also opens up new perks ah, for you to get next time you've earned a skill point. I see. So you drift and e-drift scores are increased. You earn 25% more credits when you beat a driver tar in a head-to-head -head race. Your drafting skill scores are increased by 10%. Your clean streak and clean smart scores are increased by 25%. Sweet. Recalculating route. The man who ran. A buddy, Alan Hartman. Oh. Let's see if I can take this guy out. Got some rain. Hey, it's Ben. How's the weather hey, looking out there? It's raining. The handling can get a little lively in the rain. Gonna take a shortcut there, not a good idea. Probably would have taken me down the wrong path. I 
wonder if that's just because their level one is the number one, so that's my guess. And for wet payment, it didn't seem that much different. Yeah, it's sure it's sliding a little bit more. In 400 yards, turn right. Adjustment here. Forgot my uh got screwed hey, over here, guys. Actually, I didn't know you were here today. Yeah, with that rain, we had a few Couple spin outs. Wasn't tightened down. My work's all piled up. Hey, guys, this is Ashley. She's in charge of garage services for Horizon. Hey guys, if you need anything, tuning, painting, upgrades, spares, whatever, come to me. I got you covered. Okay, getting down here was a bit of fun, but now it's time to get serious. I want to find out who's the best driver. Aren't you the best driver, Ben? They had a race against you. Come on. I paid her to say that. OK, we've got a bunch of events arranged around this area. Guy looks like a young Dan Greenewalt. No offense, Dan. You're, you're about my age there, buddy. There are 168 different championships to compete in at Horizon featuring nearly 700 events. You can take part in all of them while you're here. We'll do one championship at each location, and then the road trip moves on to its next destination. The championship you enter is determined by the car you've chosen to drive. You're driving the Camaro, so I've signed you up for the Castelletto American Racers Championship. The Camaro. This will be a three-race championship. Go ahead and choose which one you'd like to attempt first. All right. American Racer Sprint Race, Clint's Cliffside Sprint, Circuit Race. Go ahead, choose a race. I, I am, Ben, slow down. Cross country, I think I'm gonna go try the circuit race. B, resume. The garage is now open if you want to upgrade your car or get a new paint job. I'm trying to see what. There's the e brake. Whoa! It said the clutch would act as an e brake. Let's see if I can get that. Maybe there was something in the settings. Since I can't use it as a clutch, I might as well... Uh... Yeah, it says it's the e-brake. Interesting. Well, it says it should act as the e-brake, but... Looks like my e-brake is the B button. In 400 yards, bear right. Whoa! We still got some. Uh, That was a weak speed trap. Still got some water on the ground here. Keep right. In 200 yards, turn right. Turn right. Yep, trying to get fancy. I like the default field of view, at least for this car. In 
400 yards, turn left. Turn left. Do a little cross country action. Whoops. You have arrived at your destination. Wonder why I didn't show any damage there. Okay, this is your first championship race. It'll be a real step up from the heats. This is where it gets serious. I think I can do a little tuning movie. Take a little air pressure out. sleep in there. Two lap race. Try to turn down the degrees of rotation after this race and see if... Smokey and the Bandit right in front of me. I'm gonna see if I can feel, get a little more force feedback feel. You know, I like the way it feels with this 900 degrees of rotation, especially with this car. Got my work cut out here. Bumping and banging here. Hopefully pick up some positions. Whoa, whoa! That was more like a lot of bumping and banging. Oh, it's gonna be a race to the finish! Man, these dudes started pulling me big time. Hell. Kind of One push down, my friend. You're doing good. Keep this up, and this championship is yours. Kind of pushed my way to the front there, but uh, that was fun. Oh, watch replay. Let's check that out really quick. Man, if I was caught sleeping at the line there, I was messing around. Look, lost three positions there. I might have won it.
me. Nice helicopter view. Really sweet. Let's try to turn down the rotation here. That should be 540 or 720. No, that should be 360 or so. All right, let's go back to. We award points based on finishing position. If you want to win it, you need to be at the top of this table at the end of the championship. Wow, you got yourself a nice clean racing bonus in that one. Nice driving, mate. Thank you. It's not like I can advance through this stuff. This is Rivals, the best way to compare your skills with your friends and everyone else at the festival. Um, no, I'm not gonna race Rivals right now. Every time you level up, you get a wheel spin. This gives you the chance to win big cash payouts or even get a free car. So it said push that button to open up the map. So I'm assuming I gotta go, yeah, this one I just did. Travel discount board. So that's the next festival. Oh, look, I got some. Barn finds. AU Jubies discovered four. Community. Progress. Cool. Marketplace. Car packs. Car pass. VIP membership. Oh yeah, it changes the degrees of rotation. Definitely heavier. In 400 yards, turn right. Turn right. So I'm gonna turn it back up a little bit. Let's see if I go to the settings. Oh, what? I didn't go all the way down. Force feedback up. Vibration up. Oh, Darren, shame on you. Okay. I can't believe I missed that. Well, at least I caught it now. So now my wheels should match up. Oh yeah, much heavier. Yeah, boy! Whoa, big difference. In 400 yards, turn left. Wow, that, that doubled it, basically. Turn left. In 100 yards, turn right. Oh, almost pulled that off. You know what? Now that I found that, let's go back to 900 degrees here. Oh, man, I feel stupid. I can't believe I didn't see that arrow down there. 
Yeah, let's go back to 900 degrees. I could have maybe, maybe pulled off that Brody around that corner. Whoa! <laughs> Whoops! Ouch! Ooh, the Camaro sounds a little beat up. Yeah, here it's missing. Right, let's wreck it again. BAM! Can I repair it? You have arrived at your destination. Oh, looks like I gotta go back a little bit. And I hope the car's reset, because that thing is beat to hell. Work cut out if it's Smokey and the Bandit. All right, this may be your first championship, but we are throwing you in at the deep end. This is our first cross country event of the summer. It's a brand new event at Horizon. You'll be taking on all kinds of terrain, so keep your eyes on the next checkpoint and focus. 10 4. What are options? Oh, same as before. Dirt. Oh, cars reset. And you caught my pants down there. That feels cool. Force feedback vibration feels really cool. Whoa! That wheel is dancing. And when they say cross country, whoa, no! Dead last now. Do some catch up here. No. Awesome. Whoa. Damn. Man, this is no mess around. Oh, I think I'm off the beaten path Hold now. On, you missed the checkpoint. Oh crap. Man, this is no playing. Found the cornfields. I'll try that one again.
have to be honest, it's going to be tough to win from here. All right, you restart. might want to retry this race. I agree. Got to restart it. That was fun. Man, I think I'm just gonna stay with these guys. Oh man, they spun me! track of the map. Force feedback feels great over this terrain. Yeah! I gotta say. I gotta say, this is much harder than Forza Horizon. I can also say, I can see why they had to go with 30 frames a second, man. There is lots of action going on. I am not doing well, but that was fun. All right, let's move on. I just watched a little replay here. That was pretty awesome. Almost running out of time here, 50 minutes. figure out where I go wrong here. Now definitely driving from a different view is gonna make a big difference. I can see a lot more where I look where I lost it. Oh and I got hammered. It is not easy to keep it straight. There we go. like a TV camera where you can... Awesome. It's always difficult to take a picture with the uh, wheel. This is where an extra set of uh, effects mode. Cool. That's where an extra gamepad really comes in handy. 
Yeah, because you got both the, uh, the sticks. All right, let's go to the next, uh, my wheel's off a little bit here. Wow, top drive in there, mate. The crowd were going Not nuts. Really. You say so, Ben. No thanks. So I'm going to go to the next event, run that really quick for you guys, and then uh, wrap up this first hour. Yeah, my, re my wheel reset there. So let's bring up the map. Speed trap there. Turn right. Something new I've organized for this year's festival is the Horizon Bucket List. A list of things you've just got to do while you're at the festival. Okay, I've had cars like this place all over Europe. Inside the car, you'll find a set of instructions, a challenge. If you only complete one thing this summer, make it a bucket list. Okay, Shh. might as well. The heck? Drive a Konasig Egera like you stole it. <laughs> One down, but they won't all be this easy. 164. It's hauling some ass there. That was cool. Found my first bucket list. I wonder if it takes me back to my car. Assuming it does. Top speed 195. Damn, that Konasek hauls <laughs> You look like you enjoyed that. You can go again as many times as you like. Car up on the way. That's 
time the thing turned into a friggin' sled. Yards, turn right. Turn right. In four hundred yards, turn left. Destination. There it is. All right, my last event here. That I'll uh, conclude my first hour. I think I'm going to do more. I think I'm going to do hour two and going to do some multiplayer. I, I, I got an invite to a multiplayer race takes place in about 20 minutes, so we're going to hook up with Brian Meckberg, and uh, let's just go for this. See what this thing's like in multiplayer. Okay, let me get back on track here. Off me! Break out cook. I was getting greedy. My own fault. Dang it. I mean, they were staying on track too. I could have picked up some serious. And I'm going to go from freaking first to last here. Ah, bummer. Well, I think that's going to wrap things up for now. Go out on a replay here and uh, give some first impressions. This is a lot of fun. Uh, force feedback is definitely heavy, strong. Man, going off road, it feels great. Uh, I love the full use of the 900 degrees of rotation. It, you know, I in uh, Forza Motorsport 5, you had to turn it down to get a good feel as far as the degrees of rotation on the force feedback side. But it feels great. It's a lot of fun. Actually, I need to hook up uh, one of my other wheels, one of my 458 GTA, GTE Italia rim, which I like. Probably do some drifting, a little bit better drifting, because this, you know, this is an odd shaped kind of a hexagon, I guess. I don't know my geometry all that well. Um, kind of a hexagon shape. I bet I could drift a little bit better with a round rim. Um, but this is, and I'm gonna have hours of fun with Forza Horizon 2. So hopefully you've enjoyed this first hour of uh, gameplay of Forza Horizon 2 by uh, Turn 10 and Playground Games. 
and it's going to be available September 30th. Also available on the 360. Don't they didn't give me a copy of that to play, so I don't I don't think I'm I'm gonna even give that a try because why would I when I have the Xbox One version? The driver tar, man, the driver tars drove clean and fast. I think here's where my choke was coming up here. Yep, this is where I tried to make the snake right through there, and bam, hit the blue Camaro and spun it. Oh man, I was I was en route to get right up to the front there. Anyway, that's a lot of fun, and looking forward to trying multiplayer. Gonna have a, a, a segment on that, probably hour two and maybe even beyond. I, I'm probably gonna do some let's play of this because it's just so much fun, uh, and hopefully have a bunch of these out before uh, launch time. Anyway. Come to our website, we'd love to have you there to talk about Forza Horizon 2 and you can like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, subscribe to us here on YouTube. A like or a thumbs up would be much appreciated. I'm Darren Gange for Inside Sim Racing. See you guys next time.